You've seen his work many, many times, and it probably got you thinking. He's the editorial cartoonist for the Scranton Times, Tribune, and Sunday Times. News 22's Jane Adonisio visited with him in his Scranton studio. Dennis Drun's job involves poking fun at issues of the day, especially politics, through caricatures with a few balloons over their heads. As the editorial cartoonist for the Scranton Times for the past 12 years, even his name suggests how he makes a living. Drun says Scranton is ripe with possibilities. Mayor Connors, who's, who's now leaving us after 12 years, has been uh, a wonderful font of inspiration for... <laughs> <laughs> for cartoons. He's almost like a human cartoon, so <laughs> I'm sort of, sort of sad to see him go. So sad that Drawn even illustrated himself crying after Jimmy Connors lost the May primary. For inspiration, Dennis reads five or six newspapers a day, but it could take hours for him to get just the right idea. Not only do you have to know what's happening in the news, but you also have to have a fairly, I think, fairly liberal education because a lot of the ideas you're drawing from, you know, things from uh, children's fairy tales to, you know, just oddball cliches that you've learned over the years, you have to be able to mine uh, cultural metaphors that everyone has in common to be able to get across an idea. Once he has the idea, the actual drawing takes about an hour, but he's usually working against a deadline. But that's not all. Drawn's often found himself in a bit of trouble. I've gotten trouble from readers, from my employers, from, from any number of things. But you know, that, that's part of the job. And, and really, if you never got in trouble as an editorial cartoonist, you're probably not being very effective. You can be sure Dennis Drawn is very effective. In Scranton, Jane Adonisio, News 22. Dennis says he's taking a good look at the candidates who will replace Jimmy Connors as Scranton's mayor, who, by the way, has taken Drawn's work in stride. There you go. Yeah, Love it. Good sense of humor. Yeah, you have to. Why not? And you're going to need a good sense of humor this weekend, too, yeah. because we're going to get some rain.